Pizza party. Pizza party. Pizza party. Pizza party. <laughs> Um, it's menage a trois. We are trying three different pizzas. We are going with pizza pizza, El Granello's, and pizza pino. I'm Faye. I'm Nikki. And this is our pizza party. <laughs> You've entered our pizza party. You're the third. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess we kind of wanted to try out like a lower end pizza place versus a more, well it's not gourmet, but a higher end pizza place. Yes. Pizza chain, so uh, lower end pizza chain, higher end pizza chain. Yes. And then like a mom and pop kind of shop. Yes. And you wanted to compare and see which one was better. Compare, contrast, taste, and see. So the pizza pizza, we got the cauliflower crust and we made it a Canadian pizza. So yes. your typical pepperoni, Bacon, bacon crumbles oh. and bacon crumbles. Same thing, right? Yeah. And mushrooms. mushrooms. Um, so this was 18 something. 18 something. And I know that doesn't really seem like lower end, but it's because we got the, the cauliflower cauliflower. Cauliflower crust. crust. But usually it goes from anywhere, probably like eight bucks or yeah. so. And we also wanted to try something new because, you know, Pizza Pizza is so um, common, available and yeah. common everywhere. So they currently have this new pizza crust made out of cauliflower. It's really good. Like it's, I don't know if it's gluten free, but I know it's keto friendly. That's all I know. And then from Il Fernello, we got, it was called the fungi. Yeah. Pizza fungi. Okay. On the pizza fungi, there is whipped herb and lemon ricotta. Oh, that's what mm. it is. That's yeah. what made my ricotta with lemon. My and mouth water. Wet. Whip. That means that I'm expecting it to be like really soft and like heavenly. I don't know what telegio, tele, telegio. I'm saying that wrong. I butchered that. I don't know what that is. Telegio. <laughs> telegio. You think that's a cheese? Telegio. <laughs> Um, I'm guessing it's whatever this is. Oh, is. okay, okay, yeah, yeah, maybe. A uh, fior de latte. That's definitely a cheese, I think. Yeah. And because latte is milk, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Mushrooms, spinach, and olive oil. So that's, okay. that's what's on the pizza fungi. Telgio. So it was seventeen ninety five before tax. Before and then tax. 19 and then nineteen seventy with the tax. Yes. Should we open that? Yeah, let's just open it so we could like see it all together. And then here, our last one, Pizza Pino, our mom and pop shop. Mm -hmm. uh, so, um, I got the Pino special, which is pepperoni, bacon, mushrooms, green peppers, and onions. Mm -hmm. Pretty basic. They have other ones, like fancier ones, meat lovers, Greek, Mediterranean, mm -hmm. like chicken club, all these different ones, but we just went with the basic Pino special. Yes and just like basic toppings that we're used to. And if you can see the difference, you can tell like the cheese is melted on the top and keeps all the ingredients in. Mm -hmm. And then these ones, the toppings are on top of top the cheese. cheese. Yeah, yeah. Which, you know, if we did get it fresh, then at least we would see like the difference of the consistency or the stringing of the cheese, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. which I really love, but it's okay. <laughs> when you have a pizza party, yeah. you don't expect it. Well, we had to pick up three pizzas, so the yeah. temperature has, it's not at its optimal temperature. But yes, and it'll still be good. So what do you want to start with first? I don't know, what do you want to start with first? I don't know, I'm just really hungry. I know. Okay, how about we just start with our pizza pizza. Okay, pizza pizza, it actually, can we start with the pizza pizza? Oh, you want to start with the pizza pizza? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Mom and Pops. Mom okay. and Pop shop. Pizza Pino. <laughs> so this is actually pretty popular uh, with the West End crowd. When I lived in Pickering, like it's, it's yeah. This is one of the places that people go if you ask for pizza on the West, uh, East End. I'm gonna get one. Oh, get you can see that it's loaded with toppings. Yes. And like, they're not, they're very, what is it? They're not skimpy on the top. They're not skimpy. So they're very generous. Very generous. That is why they're pretty popular because you can see how thick it is. Um, even though there's two of us, we, we would probably get full off of one small pizza because they're just super thick yeah, and loaded thick. with toppings. Mm -hmm. 
Mmm. The toppings are really fresh. You can taste it in the green peppers. Mm hmm And the onion. Mmm. And the bacon. It's, it's thick. Is it bacon bits too or are they... Is there bacon? Taste the bacon for sure. That My first bite had a lot of bacon. Really? Maybe you didn't get a piece of bacon yet. Maybe I didn't get bacon. Oh yeah, the bacon. Mm-hmm. Right? Yeah. Bacon strips. Not even yeah. the bacon bits. Yeah. It was a big chunk I got in the, that first bite. And Actually, can... this crust good. isn't too bad. I was expecting it to be a little mm -hmm. doughy, but it's kind of like pizza crust, or pizza crust, pizza hut. Not as oily, it's like fluffy. It's fluffy, mm -hmm. but crispy on the outside. What do we want to eat next? Because, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to try this now. I'm excited. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, delicious. Is it? Mm -hmm. oh, it's so tasty. I love mushrooms. You could definitely taste the lemon and the ricotta. That's exactly what I was hoping the ricotta would taste like in like the texture. Mm -hmm. Like just fluffy. This would have been so good like right out mm -hmm. of the oven. Mm -hmm. I'm sad that it's cold. I know. My spinach is a bit cold. <laughs> but it's still really good. Mm -hmm. You can definitely tell like in the higher end pizza oh, yeah. like it has like Better ingredients. Yes. Have you got to this part? What part? Telegree. Telegio. Oh, I Telegio. <laughs> Telegio. <laughs> We're guessing that's the Telegio. 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 What is it? It looks like some sort of like vegetable. Like an artichoke. I thought it was an artichoke the first time I saw it, but that's not mm. one of the ingredients listed. I'm Googling it. Google it. It's probably meat. Imagine Cheese. It. Pork. Oh. So it didn't. I thought it was a vegetable when I saw it because they left the rinds on the cheese. Ah. With an right? unusual fruity tang. Okay. Ah. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I, I think it's really hard to compare. It's just basically mm. what you prefer during that time. Mm -hmm. But this is our first time trying. Actually, yeah, it's the first time I'm trying all three of these. Really? I've never had pizza pinos. So this is my first time. I really like it. I've had pizza pino before. I've had il fornello, but I've never tried the fungi pizza. Mm. So this is my first time trying the fungi pizza. And I've had pizza pizza before, obviously. Yes, but we've never but had, we've never had the, cauliflower, the cauliflower crust before. Mm. It looks like regular crust. You can't even tell. If you told me it was just regular crust, I would have thought it was just a thin crust pizza. Mm -hmm. I guess we'll just leave it to the taste to mm -hmm. see if it passes. Mm -hmm. Okay, ready yes. for the the cauliflower, cauliflower. pizza pizza. Um, I don't even know if this is cauliflower. It better be. It says cauliflower. <laughs> What if it's not even cauliflower? No, it can't not be cauliflower. <laughs> it can't not be cauliflower. They, it cannot. they stuck a cauliflower sticker on the bottom. I know, but it just doesn't <laughs> look like cauliflower. It's gotta be, it's gotta be. What do you think? It tastes like normal dough. It, but it's gotta be cauliflower. No way, I don't, I don't believe that it's not. Why is it so doughy? Look, it, t it doesn't taste like, it tastes different. That's pretty good for a cauliflower. But it doesn't taste like the regular pizza pizza crust. No, it doesn't. It doesn't taste like cauliflower either. No, it doesn't. It tastes like crust, but it doesn't taste like the pizza pizza crust, which is why I'm believing this is cauliflower. But it's very crusty mm -hmm. for cauliflower. Yeah, it's very doughy for mm -hmm. a cauliflower. <laughs> ah, I think you should try this one. <laughs> you should have all three. Yeah. You have so much. This one? You yeah. should be our third. You want to be our third? No, yeah, you should have been our third. No, 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 I just like getting drunk in the background. <laughs> but you could just be like, yeah. You could just be drunk in the background. Mm, this is our third. <laughs> mm, this is delicious. Why don't you come? Oh, now I taste the cauliflower. Yeah. Hmm? You got that trick. <laughs> I know, right? This is regular crust. Regular. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I feel like it's regular crust, but 
I can taste the cauliflower. Mmm. I'm like really pleasantly surprised that this is good. Mm hmm. I mean, hoping that. I didn't think I would like this one at all. Mm -hmm. But I'm surprised. This is the one I was least looking forward to. Mm hmm. Do you think it's worth it? I guess if you're going, for, if you want to be healthy, then I guess it would be worth it. Mm -hmm. But if we're gonna be around that price range, I would probably go for that. Go with this one, yeah. But again, it's based on your taste buds. Because mm -hmm. like, I don't know if I would pay for that price if I didn't want to have that topping on it. Yeah. Like I wouldn't, I wouldn't go to this place and just buy a pepperoni. Thumbs up for all. Thumbs up for all. Depends what you want. Depends on our verdict. Exactly. <laughs> cauliflower. That's not really a verdict, but holy, like yeah. cauliflower crust, like just really blew my mind. That surprised me. I yes. didn't think I would like it. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna I'm be pleasantly all of surprised. It too. I would actually order this again mm -hmm. because I'm. I'm pleasantly surprised with the cauliflower crust. Mm -hmm. This I knew I would like. I love pizza, especially when it's the more higher end pizza. I do love the higher end ingredients. And this this was this is good too. Just as good. Um, I love the homey feel to it. Mm -hmm. And like I love that they're very generous with their toppings. Yes. And like I wish that we did get it like right when it was I wish all of them yeah, were still were like warm. fresh and warm. So our verdict is no verdict. Yay for all, mm -hmm. no winner. Depends what you want. Yep. But I would definitely go back to all three places. Mm -hmm. Let us know what you think. Um, let us know if you've tried any of this or any suggestions that you would like us to try, especially pizza. We could have another pizza party. Pizza party. So like, comment, subscribe, subscribe and share. And we'll see you at our next video. Bye -bye. Oh, I'm gonna burp. <laughs> I already burped like four like, times. Ah, ah, bah. The bye bye. 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 So I just found out that this whole time that I thought this was keto friendly. We looked up all the ingredients and it's not keto friendly. Blah, blah. But it tastes good. It does.